Now we're going to see a close-up of the actual rinsing process as well as the process involved in uh, punching the septum and drawing up the sample. So as you see here, the rack moves into position. Now the syringe goes and uh, rinses. Sprays out what's in the syringe, moves down to draw up rinsing liquid. And that liquid is drawn up and flushed through the syringe. Now the, the liquid is sprayed back out into the waste. Now the septum is punched. The sample is being drawn up and once the sample is drawn up it's going to move over and begin spraying. Now we're going to see the actual sample application process a little more up close. So now the instrument moves over, sprays a waste spot onto the waste plate, then moves into position and begins to spray the first track which is from vial number one. This is two microliters of our uh, standard, the glycerizic acid standard. And as you can see, it's spraying on to the plate. And once it's finished, it moves over. It's going to go over and rinse now. And then after rinsing, it will draw up the sample from the second vial. And we'll come over and spray that as well. We'll give it a few seconds to do that. And soon you'll see the, the assembly come over and we'll spray another waste spot again. And then move over and spray the first of three bands from the second vial. This is the largest band first, which is the six microliter band from our reference vial. I'm going to zoom in so you can see that a little more clearly. You'll notice that this particular ATS-4 has a heated spray nozzle so that coil you see over the spray nozzle is a, an option that you can get uh, we have on our instrument. It allows you to heat the spray nozzle while the sample is being applied and this is particularly useful if you have aqueous samples so samples that are in water um, so or, or other solvents that are not very volatile and this will help the samples be applied more cleanly, uh, will aid in the, the speed at which the sample dries on the plate. So it's a pretty, pretty useful option. As you can see, it's moving to the second vial. Or excuse me, the second track. Which is the four microliter track. And once that finishes, it will go to the third and final track from that vial, which is the two microliter track. And once that is complete, it will go and rinse, get the third vial, and we'll come over and spray the, tree, the three tracks from the third vial down as well.